Hello children, in this lesson we are going to learn how to do four digit subtraction that is how to subtract the numbers which are four digit long. Sounds scary? No, it isn't. Let's see how to do it. Let's take an example. You might have seen this story in the science lesson. See, there were 1560 trees in a jungle and of which came and cut a lot of trees from this jungle. 1250 trees she cut and why did she cut? She wanted to make that magic potion so that she can look beautiful. So she cut a lot of trees. So how many trees are left? How will we do it? Will we do addition or subtraction? There were large number of trees and she cut down 1250 trees. So how many are left? So something is going away or removing. So what do we do? We do subtraction in this case. So how do we do it? We write down 1560 trees were there originally so we write it down correctly with the right place value 1000 1 comes at the thousand place 560 so 500 so 5 comes below the hundred position 60 so 6 comes here and 0 here ensure you write the numbers correctly at their place values and you write these things also so that if you don't forget it and how many trees this cruel witch cut? 1250. Again, we write the second number that how many trees were removed in this case. We write it just like right way with their right place values. So, what do we do? 1250. So, we write one here at the thousand place. 200. So, 2 at the hundredth place. 50 means 5 tenths here. And 0. Ensure you write both the numbers correctly as well as in their correct place value position. So there were originally this many trees minus this many trees. We want to find out how many trees are left in that jungle. And how do we do that? We start from one's position and then we do subtraction of two digits at a time. That is ones position we subtract these two digits then we move to tens position and subtract these two digits at the tens place then we do at the hundredth position and then we repeat the same thing at the thousands position so it's very similar to three digit subtraction which we saw in the earlier lesson only thing is there is one extra set of digits at the thousands place otherwise but the steps remains exactly the same. You start from one's position and you move leftwards. Ones to tens, tens to hundred and thousand. Two digits at a time. So though it's a big number but I told you it's easy. You are finally doing subtraction of two single digit numbers at a given time. So let's do it. We want to do 0 minus 0 is 0. 6 minus 5 is 1. 200 position 5 minus 2 is 3 then we move to thousands position that is 1 minus 1 is 0 so how many trees were left 310 trees were left in that jungle 1560 trees were there originally and 1250 trees that cruel witch cut to make that magic potion like you saw in that science video magic potion of the witch to watch it so only 310 trees were left in the jungle and as a result of this tree cutting what happened a huge flood came in that jungle and then that witch realized what was her problem because trees are very important for the environment right Let's take another problem. Mohan is a cloth merchant and he 
basically sells cloth every day let's say in his shop he had 1100 meters of cloth and that month he sold 815 meters of cloth in that month that's why he's happy he sold a lot of cloth he should be happy right if he wants to find out how much cloth is left in his shop for the next month how will he do it he will do subtraction right he had 1100 meters of cloth and 815 meters are sold so how much is left we will put 1100 here with the correct place value 1000 below the 1000, 100 below the 100, tens below the tens, ones below the ones and then we write 815 below it do we write 8 from here? no 815 so we write 8 at its place value that is below the hundredth position don't write 8 here it's thousands position he sold 8 hundred and fifteen no thousand years so we leave it empty eight hundred and fifteen so we write both the numbers according to their place value one thousand one hundred and eight hundred and fifteen if sold this month and how will we do it subtraction starting from one's position we'll subtract so what is going to happen here 0 minus 5 when we do what happens can we subtract a larger number for smaller no we learned this thing in our last lesson right so what happens this one's position number tells its tens position number so we are going to do this subtraction from one's position then moving to tens position then moving to hundredth position and then moving to thousands position let's do it 0 minus 5 I can't do it like told you larger number cannot be subtracted from a smaller number so what happens it tells to his neighbor on the left can you lend me something I have to borrow a 10 from you right so but the neighbor 10 says hey I am myself a 0 I don't have anything to lend it to you so 10s borrows from its neighbor 100 it says hey 100th number which is 1 in this case can I borrow a 10 from you the 100 number is greater than 0 right it's 1 here so it says sure I can give you a 10 so it, we cut this thing and because the 100th number is giving a 10 from it 1 became reduced by 1 so 1 minus 1 becomes 0 if this was 2 year this would have become 1 we reduce by 1 if this was 5 year it become 4 so in this example it was 1100 when you give 1 year it becomes 1 minus 1 0 and what happened to the neighbor 10 it got a 1 year which we write like this 1 0 and then what does neighbor 10 says it says I will give a 1 to my neighbor my right side neighbor so it becomes 10 minus 1 becomes 9 and then that 1 goes to its neighbor here so each neighbor is helping each other the one's position said told to the tens can I borrow it was not having so it asked its neighbor and then this neighbor became from 1 to 0 it gave a 1 here and then this neighbor became 10 and then it gave 1 to its 1's position and it became 9 and now we can do the subtraction now we have a 10 here which is greater than 5 so 10 minus 5 is 5 so we have done 1's place subtraction then we go to the 10's place then we do 9 minus 1 is 8 very easy then we come to the 100th position oops 100th position is only left with 0 can we take 8 from 0? 0 minus 8 can we do? No. So what does 100th position says? It goes to its left neighbor that is 1000 place and says can I borrow from a 1 from you? It says sure I can give you. So it cut itself and what will happen here? 
1 will be reduced by 1 anything which is here will be reduced by 1 so it was 1 here so 1 minus 1 became 0 and that 1 is lent to its right side neighbor so it became 10 it was 0 previously we got 1 so it became 10 now from that 10 I can easily remove 8 so 10 minus 8 is 2 so the final answer of this problem is Mohan at 1100 meters of cloth in his shop at the start of the month and this month was a great month a festival month he sold 815 meters of cloth so he has 285 meters of cloth remaining in his shop and how did we do this thing doing subtraction of two single digit at a given point of time and we started from one's position and then we moved left let's take another problem let's say Rajat bought a dress costing 756 rupees and let's say he gave 1000 rupees to the shopkeeper so his dress costed 756 rupees and he gave 1000 rupees to the shopkeeper so how much the shopkeeper should return back how do we do it do we add these two numbers or we do subtract we do subtraction because Rajat is taking a dress costing 756 rupees and he's giving a thousand rupees so as a change back the shopkeeper will do 1000 minus 756 and how do we do it we write 1000 like this and sure you write at the correct place values 1000 1 at the thousand place and all zeros minus 756 there was no thousands here so we leave it empty and 700 so it right below the hundredth place 7 56 5 tens and a 6 and how do we do it again we start from one's position subtract the two digits then a tens position and so on so let's do it so we start from one's position 0 minus 6 that's not possible so 0 tells to its neighbor 10 can I borrow a 10 she says, sure but oops I am also a zero I can't give you anything let me borrow from my neighbor so tenth neighbor is hundred so it goes and says eight digit at the hundredth place can you give me a one the hundred digit looks itself and says oops I am also a zero let me ask my thousands place number so each neighbor is finally trying to help its neighbor but because they are themselves are zero and zero cannot lend right anything there is nothing there so it go, going to its left side neighbor the larger neighbor goes to the thousands neighbor and says hey thousands neighbor can I borrow a one the thousand neighbor says sure I can give you I am greater than zero so one at the thousands neighbor what he does it gives a one to its hundredths neighbor so it itself became a zero one minus one became zero then a one is uh, added to the hundred position digit so there was zero there and one is written like this so it became 10 now because it needs to lend to its neighbor what is going to happen 10 is going to be reduced by a one it's going to become nine and a one is going to be added to the tens position digits added in the sense you write it like this so it's like one zero ten now what's going to happen this neighbor also needs to give to this remember we started from here to this direction from right to left finally now everybody is having something to lend to its neighbor so they are giving so 10 became 9 and the 1 comes to the 1's position right so now this number at 1's position has become 10 so now we can do 10 minus 6 it's greater than 6 right greater than 6 10 so we can subtract 10 minus 6 is 4 then we go to the tens position 9 minus 5 is again a 4 then we go to 100 position 9 minus 7 is 2 then we go to the thousand position 0 minus 0 is 0 so Rajat will get 244 rupees back from that shopkeeper because he gave a thousand rupees note and he purchased a 
cloth of only 756 rupees and what we did in this case we started from one's position but problem was this number at the top was lesser than the smaller one so it went to its neighbor but the neighbor itself was zero so it went to its neighbor that was also zero so it went to finally here and then the lending happened from this neighbor a one came here it became 10 then we became 9 because it wants to lend to its neighbor then this guy became 10 it needs to lend to its neighbor so it became 9 10 minus 1 9 and then it came here right so it's pretty simple if you look at it if you have only thing you need to do is write the numbers correctly and start doing the subtraction of starting from one's position and finish it right and if the number at the top is lesser than the below number you borrow from your left side neighbor so that's all for today children bye bye